Hi, I'm Mike with New York State Parks. I'm here today to tell you about a very rare and special plant that we have here at Clark Reservation State Park and nearby Chittenango Falls State Park, the American Heartstung Fern. Scientific name, Asplenium scolopendrium variety Americanum. In fact, about 95% of all heartstung ferns in New York State can be found between these two central New York State parks. The American Heartstung Fern has a range in the United States and Canada going from Tennessee and Alabama in the south to New York, Ontario, Canada, and Michigan in the north. The exact reasons why the heart's tongue fern is so rare are not fully understood, but we do know many things about them. We do know that they're extremely sensitive to changes in climate, and we know that they have very specific habitat preferences. The heart's tongue fern is strongly associated with the Onondaga escarpment, a rocky outcropping that was formed during the last glacial age. The fern has such specific requirements that it is almost always found on the steep north to east facing slopes of glacial ravines and plunge basins, and often with a sizable cliff face sheltering them from above. In the early to mid 20th century, several populations of heart's tongue fern were lost due to quarrying, deforestation, and suburban expansion. In 1989, the heart's tongue fern was then placed on the federal endangered species list and is listed as threatened. More recently, researchers from the SUNY College of Environmental Science and Forestry in Syracuse, New York, working with the New York State Parks Forces Program, began to grow and then transplant the heart's tongue fern at several locations in Onondaga and Madison counties in an effort to augment the species populations. That program was moved to the historic greenhouses at Sonnenberg Gardens and Mansion State Historic Park in Canandaigua, New York last year and is now part of the New York State Parks Plant Materials Program. Interestingly, the greenhouses at Sonnenberg Gardens were built in the early 20th century by a woman named Mary Clark Thompson, and Mary Clark Thompson was the very same woman who donated the land that I am on today, now known as Clark Reservation State Park. With her donation, she saved six heart's tongue fern populations and this beautiful park from destruction, and her legacy now lives on as we use her greenhouses to help restore the species in New York and beyond.